and welcome in, everybody. Glad you're with us. The show has an NL East matchup. It's the Philadelphia Phillies going up against the Atlanta Braves. First pitch coming your way next. Almost ready to get underway. Pitching in our game today, Kyle Wright. But, Chris, he hasn't exactly been stellar here on his home mound. <clears throat> well, I'll say this. Every player wants to perform well at their home ballpark, in front of their fans, in front of the city. And you know this guy no different. He wants to be more effective here. So, you know, you look at the numbers. They haven't been great at home. I'm sure he wants to turn that around, and we'll see if he's able to start that in this one. And here it comes. To third, Riley. The throw to first, two away here in the top of the first. Here's Bryce Harper. In the dirt, Murphy fires the first. In time, the two three strike. And now here's the speed threat outfielder Michael Harris. Pitch is in there. It's two and two. When Nola was in college at LSU, he got a chance to play with his brother, Austin, who was the team's shortstop, and as well, his roommate was Alex Bregman. And now, Vaughn Grissom swings and misses. One and two. Swings through it, and that's a strikeout. Well, anytime you can punch out the top two guys in a lineup to start an inning, got to be feeling pretty good out there on the mound because when you think of just having a distraction, table setters on the base paths, and all of a sudden you're dealing with the number three hitter, any distraction can cause you to serve up a cookie, and instead of it being a solo shot, it's a two- or three-run homer. That's hard hit on the line. He can't get there. It's a base hit. Now he'll turn for second. And he starts his afternoon off right with a double. He was all over that one. A well-deserved double on a great swing. Got everything going on time. He stayed balanced. And he squared it up about as well as you could possibly ask. Here's Ronald Acuna Jr. at the plate. Swing and a miss. And a count one and two. Well, here's a chance right here for one of the better hit. Got him swinging. Snuck the fastball by him. Braves strand one. We played back at Truist Park. Top of the second. And digging in for Philadelphia, Kyle Schwarber. I'm Schwarber. Next one is off the play. Two and two. And a pitch. Foul ball, another 2-2 upcoming. Right-hander kicks, deals. And a good eye there. Really good take, especially with two strikes. This Get one in the ball. air center field. Harris racing after it. Makes the grab, tracks it down after the long run. And there's one away. The pitch. No score here in the second. Next pitch misses. Ball three. That one fouled off. And a 3-2. In the air, right side. Under it is Acuna to make the grab. Here's Nicholas Castellanos. Here's a 1-1. One -one. Good eye right there. That misses the zone. Three balls and a strike. And the right-hander deals. 
Ripped get on the line. Ball. Nicky, get up. <sighs> and it hops over the wall for an automatic double. So, man aboard. And the batter now is Reese Hoskins. No hits in the shutout last night. Worm burner into the outfield for a knock. Runner holds it third, so even with two outs, they didn't risk it. Love how he let that ball travel, trusted his hands. Nice job of going the other way. Two gone with runners at the corners. This is Bryson Stott. And a pitch. And downstairs. Well, the offense really struggled last night. I mean, it was awful. So I, I think picking up a run right here, that's going to get him going a little bit. Kicks and fires. Swing and a miss, and now two and two. Left hand hitter waits. That one missed. 3 2, two out, runner on first. A lot of movement in the infield. Hitters got to stay focused on the pitch. And he deals. Gets a piece there. We'll do it again. And they're all loaded up. Well, the stage has been set for this offense, Boo. It's all about creating opportunities, and this is one of them right here. Brandon Marsh steps to the plate. Go on. Line drive, that's a base hit. Row home, not in time. The run scores. And it's 1 0. Big broadhead. Come on. A couple of singles back to back. I could watch base hits like that one all day long, and so could every hitting coach in the league. Just a nice line drive into center field. Trey Turner at the plate. Strike two. Two strikes. Righty to the plate. Out to short, and he can't come up with it. Let's go. Runner from third comes across, and they lead by three. No throw. He's safe at first. And up to the plate is JT Real Muto. Right with a throw over. Turner back easily. Good speed on the base pass. He handles the bat very well. I wouldn't be surprised if the skipper puts on some type of hit and run or run and hit. 1 1 now. And a swing and a miss there. On the mound, he's got to remember his offense can score a lot. So if he can hit the reset button from here going forward, there's still a chance that his club can win this ball game. And now it's even up. And a swing and a miss. Good job at damage control right there. He runs for him here, <laughs> and they move ahead. Kicks and deals. Swing and a miss. Two balls, two strikes. Swing and a ground ball out to short. Zips it to first. One up, one down. Yeah, I'm looking at his body language, and he just that doesn't seem like things are in sync. And the ball's just not coming off his back the way it did earlier in the regular season. Got the back going too soon. It's strike two. Foul ball still a one and two count. One down, base is empty. Hacks and misses. It's a yeah. strikeout. Ozzy Albies up to the plate. Here comes the We pitch. did line up today against Aaron. Late that time, and it's strike two. Noel is a guy who registers a lot of strikeouts. In fact, he's had 220 or more strikeouts in three different seasons. Good morning, seasons. everyone. How are we? The 2-2 two -two on the way. Cut on and miss. Struck him out. 
And good work there as he gets a one, two, three. I think the key is arm action on the changeup. When you can sell it like a... Welcome back. Now, All Bryce right. Harper. 2-2 two, two now. Hit pretty well in the air out to center. Harper retired. One down. Kyle Schwarber comes up to hit here. The why to kick the pitch. And another ball. Swing and a miss, and now two and two. The pitch. Spoils that one, and it remains two and two. Way inside, gets out of the way. Out towards right center field. And it falls. So they get a man aboard with a one-out single. Well, the last 10 games or so have been anything but fun at the plate for him, so that one has to feel good. Hooked around that pitch on the outside, but he was still able to square it up pretty nicely, and that takes quick, strong wrist to pull that off. And now it's Alec Bohm. He's 0 for 1. The pitch. And that misses off the outside edge. And it's fouled away. Two two. That's a little bit low. <laughs> At the belt Neil fires. Butters. Runner on the goal, Olsen. Over to Albies. Back to first. Double play. Stay nice slow. job getting over. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. Here's Orlando Arcia. Hit on the ground to the right side. Sneaks through. Oh, yeah, base hit. Yeah. So a man on base to start the inning. Here's Sean Murphy. Drilled the center. That's way back. And you can't forget it. Oh, run. Change up up in the zone is a hitter's dream. It's a BP fastball, but you're playing in real time. Most times, the pitcher's asking for a new baseball, just like right there. Here's a one-two. In the air, left field. Chorber on the run. Oh, and he whips on it. see a lot of triples Triple, he dropped the, the ball corner like that but clearly they had some trouble with it out there and he didn't hesitate rounding the bases for a second fouls it off still one and two and a pitch that to right Harper has a beat on it drops into the glove runner tagging from third throw cut off down to the plate slide save it's 3-3. Three, three. No, that's the third run of the inning, and these guys are doing a nice job of executing at the plate right now. That one down the line. Part of the order coming through now, and with one home run already in this inning, they're definitely looking to do some more damage. That one ripped right center field, and it's off the top of the wall. Throw cut off to third. He's in there. Everything came together perfectly. How did he hit that? Right there. Showed off some really nice off the pop with that swing and just couldn't get it over the fence. But I absolutely love everything about that approach and the mechanics right there. Righty delivers. Swing and a miss as he was late. 
base hit right field. Wow. In comes the run from third. It's 4-3. Anytime you rip a line drive the other way, you feel really good about what you did at the plate. You trusted your hands, you let the ball travel, and you took the ball straight to it. That's great work right there. And now they've got some speed. Runner on the goal. Swing and a miss. Real Buto throws. Not in time. It's a stolen base. Matt Olson up to the plate. He was a strikeout victim his first time. There's a strike. Well, a uh, really rough inning out there on the mound. And uh, this is one of those where you learn a lot about a guy's toughness and his ability to turn the page and keep pressing forward. Runner takes off. Pitch is high. No throw. Save the third. It's a stolen base. In the air, left side. Oh, he's got to go. High bounce takes it over the fence. Anymore. That's an automatic double. Is that? A run comes in on the play. Here oh, is Ozzy Albies up to him. Oh, he puts a great yeah, swing on that boys. pitch. And... Meanwhile, this is trouble as that's going to be extra bases. Runner from second crosses the play. It's 6-3. to three. Now in for the Braves, Orlando Arcia singled and scored his first time. Swing and a ball popped up. That one gets down for a hit. They extend their lead as the runner scores from second. And they lead by four. Comes through with the RBI. When you pop a ball up like that, you don't expect it to get you a knock too often. But right there, somehow he got it to drop in behind first base, and that's where no one could get to it. The next pitch misses. Three and two down. On the ground, right side. And it goes just foul. Swings and misses. It's a strikeout. Couldn't hit the fastball. At and welcome back. Start of the fourth. Now it's the DH. Nick Castellanos. Line drive. And that should be extra bases. Makes the turn and heads for second. In safely. It's a double at his second hit. He has had such a good day today. I don't think he's going to want to leave when it's over. A couple of doubles today for the DH. And it's Reese Hoskins up to the dish. One for one with a single and a run scored so far. So now one and two to Reese. In the dirt, blocked. And an excellent job keeping it right there. Castellanos at second with nobody out. And down on strikes. Not what you're looking for after the leadoff double. A strikeout, and there's one away. And now for the Phillies, Bryson Stock. He walked and came around to score his first time up. And a 1-1. And right back to the mound. Tosses the first. That's it out. And stepping in is the speedy Brandon Marsh. He drove in two with a single his first time up. Runner leads away at second. And a count one and two. Left-hand batter waits. Line drive, base hit. Castellanos on his way to the plate. He's in safely at second. And a run comes in to score. Okay. Here's Turner now. Man on second, two down. Ripped on a line to center. Harris tracks it down Let's for the out. out. Bottom of the inning. Now here is Michael Harris. Next offering is in for a strike. You know, these Braves really impressing me with the quality of their bats in this one. It's been fun getting a chance to see them go to work. Looking at the numbers, they've got four hits when they're behind in the count. That says these guys are absolutely battling at the plate and just not giving up, despite what the count says. Harper has a beat on it. Makes the grab one away. And if you're a manager or a hitting coach, you love to see your guys really fighting for every at-bat, every pitch. It tells you a lot about how they showed up to the ballpark today. 
puts it in the air out towards left center. Marsh pulls it down, and there's two down. Two outs, base is empty. Stepping in the long ball threat, Austin Riley. Drove it off the wall last time, just missed out on a home run. This is important. If he can go one, two, three here, it will be a very positive sign for him and for his team. Swing and a ball hammered left field, and that is gone. Man, he just barely got that one out of here, and you've got to love the effort and left to try and bring it back. He had a good shot at it, just couldn't quite pull it off. It would have been a stunner if he did. Lifted in the air, right center field. Harper ranging after it. Makes the grab on the run. And that's the inning. Braves get one on the big fly. It's now eight. Back here at the ballpark. And now it is JT Real Muto. Chris, do you know what JT stands for in JT Real Muto? Of course, Boog. It's Jacob Tyler. The wind and the pitch. And that one in the air center field. He's there. He's got it. And there's one down. Bryce Harper to the plate. The right fielder. Bryce Harper. One, two now. Base knock center field. Could be extra bases. Around first and hustling for second. And that's a two bagger. Well, here we are, third time through the order, and this is where we see the OPS jump up. Manager might have to go to the bullpen a little bit sooner than he anticipated. Stepping in, Kyle Schwarber. There's a swing and a drive. Harris going back, back some more, back some more. Up against the wall and makes the catch. Runner tagging for third. Man, I thought like that round the ball was smoked. He knew he had to get back to the track right away. Turned his back on the infield. Got to the spot, turned around and made a nice catch. The 1-1. One, one. Fought off foul. And a ball evens the count. The guy at the plate could recognize slider out of the hand. Didn't stay in the tunnel very long in terms of depth and perception. He knew right away it was an off-speed pitch. Swings and misses. Had him way out front of the... Back here in Atlanta, here's the left fielder, Marcelo Zuna. New arm out of the bullpen, Gregory Soto. He's pitching on two days rest. Gets the slider in there for a strike. You know, these Braves, simply put, are producing a lot of quality swings. It's been a real team effort. Already seven extra base hits, so that goes to show they're getting contributions from top to bottom. Nobody's doing that by themselves. Ninety-nine miles per hour to finish him off. Very strong coming out of the pen so far as he punches out the first two batters he's faced in this one. Get him straight to work. Man, it's talked about a lot. Well, got to pause on that thought as that'll do it for the... They hand the ball over to a new arm, Colin McHugh. Well, good luck against this guy. He's been extremely tough to hit this year. His numbers are excellent. The pitch. Meanwhile... Activity in the bullpen. Joe Jimenez preparing to come on if needed. That's out to center field. Harris has a beat on it. And makes the grab. And there's one down. So digging in now for Philadelphia, Reese Hoskins. One for two. This to third. Two up, two down. Two outs, bases empty. Bryson Stott stands in for the Phillies. That misses, and it's two and one. Swing and a ball lifted left field. 
That skips over the fence, so it's an automatic double. And digging in for Philadelphia, Brandon Marsh. His righty lefty splits there. And he hits a ground ball right side. Takes it himself. And that's the third out. One left for Philly. Back at Truist Park. Well, we go bottom six. And now the DH, Orlando Arcia. Two and one now. Bounced out to short. Tosses to first. One away, bottom of the sixth. So here's Murphy now. On a line, base hit. Around first, heading for two. Around second now, going for three. Cut off, throw to third. In there safely. Well, patience and discipline paid off right there as he got into an advantage count. He really shot that one down the right field line and somehow found. Swing at a bouncer, and he takes it himself for the out. Vaughn Grissom, the next to hit. Line drive, that's a base hit out of the left center field. In comes the run from third to add on. It's now nine to four. Picks himself up an RBI. Got a breaking ball on the outside part of the plate. Not a bad pitch, but he wasn't fooled or off. Oh, that got him. Well in the box, he's seen that movie before. It wasn't a good movie either. He knew how it was going to end right from the beginning. That misses. And now three balls and a strike. 3-1, and he couldn't come up with it. His ability to draw walks has been something that's been part of his career since day one. That one is absolutely belted. Gone! Wow. Grand slam! Home run number 10 of the year. A four spot on the board. It's 13-4. Well, a great job here at staying within himself. You know that if you get a knock, you're going to drive in a couple, so stay focused. Team 12 is how this one ends. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Chambi saying so long.